on the, the 7th of July, we had a meeting um, with Mr. Bishop and um, um, several of us, uh, uh, Wayne Provost, Alan, Daniel, uh, Russell, and the chairman. And what this meeting was for was is we were going to try to get some participation uh, for the, from the Gordy family uh, for this project to help cover that shortfall. We had a gap in the funding and thought this may be an opportunity to get some of that gap closed up. Uh, during the meeting, we explained the benefit of participating in the project and paying for the shortfall in funding today rather than wait. Uh, according to our policy that we have for front footage assessment, if, if they wanted to tie in in the future, they would have to pay uh, based on what their share was of the total cost based on line capacity or front footage, um, whatever their frontage would be. So we talked to them about what the advantage of uh, participating today, um, the potential of losing that capacity, uh, and going ahead and getting this project moving forward. Um, also, we discussed um, the potential that the, that the board had the option to say, no, we're not going to do this project anymore, and what that future cost would be. And it would be a significant increase in the cost if they had to do it themselves. Um, versus participating in this project in, in some form uh, to get it moving. Um, and then finally, during that meeting, we talked about, and, and actually, Mr. Bishop um, volunteered to, to contact the Gordys because we were having a little difficulty getting a response back from them on the easement acquisition. Um, through his contact with them, he, would, he agreed to make that contact and relay the urgency that we had in getting uh, at least some indication back from them about the status of that easement. Um, so that, that meeting went pretty well, and we all left there again with high hopes, but um, had to wait and see what the, what the final result was. So.